here in Piazza Vittorio, the layers of Rome are superimposed one on top of each other yet again. We have in this big 19th century square, a large ancient ruin of a fountain, of the monumental fountain of Alexander Severus. But behind it, hidden in a corner, is the remains of one of Rome's most peculiar Baroque monuments, a 17th century doorway right behind me, the Porta Magica. The Marchese Massimiliano Palombara in the 17th century wanted to transform base metals into gold, and he thought that he could do so by transforming different texts of ancient writers in Latin and in, and in Greek and in Hebrew into a kind of combination of knowledge that was in fact at the root of modern science. This is the sort of trial and error experimentation that produced science, even though this was pseudoscience, they didn't know it. And the Marchese Palombara put an inscription around the doorway of his alchemical laboratory, which they say in Rome, if it were possible to understand it and translate it properly, maybe it would still be possible to complete his dream and, ful and fulfill the great goal of every alchemist to transform copper and iron, bronze and brass into that most pure and most beautiful of metals, gold. And there's so much more to that story. Thank you.